everybody, this is Major7. I hope you will like uh, the location I've chosen uh, to start uh, this video next to my fireplace. Feeling cozy, feeling some warmth. Uh, because today is the fifth day of official quarantine and it's the first day when uh, everything basically is closed apart from places where you can buy food and medicines. So restaurants are closed, pubs and bars obviously are closed, all kind of stores are closed. Basically if we want to move from home to buy food for urgencies and necessities we have to fill this paper specifying why we are moving from home also on food from today. So all the Italian people out there following me will definitely know what I'm talking about. I just wanted all the other people outside of Italy to be aware of the situation and maybe to start questioning if their governments are doing enough to handle the situation with this coronavirus because it was underestimated by everyone. Also in Italy at the beginning the measures that we took were not enough to contain this virus. The situation of the healthcare system in Italy right now is definitely not uh, uh, the best. So to all the people that are following me from outside of Italy just know that this thing is serious so if the situation starts becoming serious in your country as well please don't underestimate this thing. Obviously I hope that it doesn't happen but uh, I just wanted you to be aware of it. Obviously this situation has its huge cons. I really um, feel the lack of uh, human relationships uh, there are some people that I'd really like to see right now, that I'd really like to hug right now, that I, I'd really like to kiss right now, but I can't. I am forced at home as the other people are. Just to be clear, I can't go to visit my mum, I can't go to visit my friends, I can't go to visit a, a girl that I'm really missing right now, I can't go to visit my brother, my nephew, my niece, my father, my grandmother. Basically I can only talk to my neighbor because my balcony and his window are connected so we can see each other from the distance and talk. I miss my students, I miss school, I miss my theater classmates, I miss all the people at Birreria Mainoni, that is the place where I usually go uh, after working in the evening. I miss my bands, my bandmates, I miss playing live. Up until now six concerts I was supposed to do were cancelled. The pros that I can find in this situation are that I have a lot of time to work on myself, I've got a lot of time to play, obviously, I've got a lot of time to take care of my house, to do the chores, to clean every corner of this house that hasn't been cleaned in months probably. And one other thing that this situation is helping me to realize is that normally uh, my rhythm is completely wrong. I run too much from one place to another, from one activity to another, I never take time for myself or I barely take time for myself at least. Also staying at home uh, in the evening is a thing I normally don't do. I usually go to the pub when I've finished working, drink a couple of beers with my friends uh, and play some board games, uh, chat. Uh, it's obviously an activity that I am missing a lot right now, but probably doing it every day, every week is a little bit too much. That's another way I'm not taking care of myself, I'm not spending time with myself, I am distracting myself from uh, other priorities. So I really hope that this situation will help us realizing uh, what are our priorities uh, and uh, will help us to work better with ourselves, uh, to uh, look inward a lot more than uh, we are used to because now we are sort of forced to do it. We are going to be in this situation for sure until the 3rd of April but my feeling is that it's probably gonna be longer than that. But cheer up, we've got the technology to keep in contact with everyone and uh, we've got a lot of time to work on ourselves. I started reading again, I haven't turned on the television during the last week, also given uh, that uh, the last time uh, I turned on the television was to do a marathon of the Lord of the Rings, uh, so I stayed in front of the television for 12 hours. Oh yes, it was the extended edition. My message right now is uh, with the means we have to stay close to one another, to think of ourselves, but to think of the community, uh, to respect these rules, uh, to be close to everyone in a different way. It's really, really important that we stay at home and we avoid uh, being part of the diffusion of this virus. So right now I'm going to cook something and then I'm not going to rush things up. I want to take more time to do everything better. 
and I'm going to practice for sure today, but I'm not releasing the last episode of uh, learning how to slap the bass. I'm going to concentrate on that today and tomorrow and I'm going to try to give my best for this thing and to close this series in the best way. So once again, thank you all for watching. Bye bye by Major 7. See you tomorrow.